So another great accessible tool that you can use in your apiary are hive lifts. For those of us that have lifting restrictions, um, myself included, having a back injury, knee and ankle injury, you know, a lot of times twisting, picking things up unnecessarily, making more work for myself causes those injuries to flare up. And so a few years back, I started working with uh, Ned Stoller of Agribility, who you saw in the, the video of last year's workshop, uh, to do a disability assessment for me and my farm based on my disabilities and the work that I do. And this was one of the recommendations that were, was given was a hive lift so that when I'm doing inspections, we talked about this, the, the important stuff is always down in the brood chamber. You know, looking for space for honey, you can oftentimes do that just looking, looking between the frames, but you're always going to have to get down in that brood chamber, whether it's checking during a hive inspection, doing a mite check, putting on mite treatments, removing mite treatments, you got to get down in there. And a lot of unnecessary lifting really makes things more difficult. Now, this hive right here has a brood chamber that is three boxes, that's three boxes deep right here, and then it's got two honey supers on right now. And so these two full honey supers right here, this is a 10 frame hive. This is about 100 pounds of excess weight. Now I need to get down in here. I like to get into that third box, kind of the middle of the brood chamber when I'm doing my inspections. So I would have to lift all of this weight of these three boxes in three individual movements if I were not to use a hive lift. Now I'm gonna show you how this hive lift works and how simple it makes my job. Just for, for your knowledge, this is a, this was about $1,500, I'm guessing about four or five years ago. I actually got this with a Farmer Veteran Coalition Fellowship. And you hear me talk about FEC all the time and this fellowship opportunity. So for those of you that are dealing with disabilities and see something like this that could make a difference in your beekeeping operation as far as uh, efficiencies, what a great thing to apply for to help you for that. And Farmer Veteran Coalition a lot of times will help fund those projects. So let's see how this works. So essentially, this is made of a few different components. I have a lever back here that is a hand crank that basically raises and lowers the clamps. And you see those clamps raising right there. So I'm gonna raise these up right to that third box. The other critical piece of this is this mechanism over here, which is your clamping mechanism. And it just uses a pressurized clamping uh, action to hold these pads right to the hive. Now there's rubberized inserts on the inside of these and basically it just clamps on real tight and it picks it up by that. This hive has been shown to uh, be able to hold up to, I think it's about 350 to 400 pounds on this, on this uh, mechanism when you're lifting up columns. So I can lift up pretty much all of my honey supers off of this, never having to lift any box and be able to do whatever management it is I want down there. So this is how it works here. So I'm gonna go ahead and get this real close to the hive. I'm gonna go ahead and raise those clamps where they need to be, which in this case, I'm gonna to have to shift this over just a little bit to get those clamps on just right. I will admit that this is a lot easier to use with deep hive bodies because of how big these clamps are, but you, they, they do work with the, with the medium hive bodies. Okay. So we're all clamped up there. I'm gonna go ahead and make sure that that propolis is nice and broken loose on there. Okay, and now we're ready to lift our hives. So now I am in the brood chamber. This is exactly where I need to be to do my management, right? So if I need to do a hive inspection, I can literally just take this entire stack of beehives and twist it around here, it's now out of my way, and I can work right here in the center of the colony. Really amazing tool that saves your back over time. There's a lot of variations of this, and in fact, in the talk that uh, you see with Ned, the workshop that we recorded last year, uh, you'll actually see him see, show you one that he made with, at, in his own workshop. So there's plans online to make these, with uh, basically with a dolly and a welder, um, you can make something like this uh, for your own apiary. Generally, um, like I said, I think this was about 1500 bucks at the time. I have heard that there is actually a U.S. producer of this. When I purchased this at the time, this came from Hungary. So there was not a, there was not a place in the United States. There was a vendor in the United States that was selling them, but there wasn't a company manufacturing these. But I've heard over the years, and I don't know of the, of the company myself, but I've heard over the years that there is a U.S. manufacturer now uh, producing something like this. So just another way to, to make things more accessible. I just lifted over 100 pounds worth of hive material right there. 
and didn't even, well, I'm breaking a sweat because I'm hot, but <laughs> I didn't even break a sweat doing that, and I'm saving my back in the meantime. All right, well,